Today, I'm building a secret room in a trampoline to hide from my girlfriend. Because ever since I was a kid, I've been obsessed with secret rooms. And I've built a few of them, but every single one has been found. So I transformed my entire house into a trampoline park to build the most insane secret room in a trampoline. Like imagine hanging out in your secret room and nobody knows it exists but you. And I'm so confident that the secret room will be secret that if my girlfriend finds me, I'll give her $10,000. My girlfriend will be here in one hour. Whoa! So let's find the best hiding spot. Go, go! Go, 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 go! Uh, actually, that way. I literally got the perfect spot for you guys to hide from a fat. What about under the air track? You no, can no, wait no, no, so no, no. much! I, I don't think you're gonna be able to lift it with oh. me on there. Plus, there's no room for us to hide underneath it. A pit! Oh. This would be the best spot to build our secret room. Literally, there's so many blocks you Wait. would never guess that it's under here. This is the worst spot. It is so shallow. There's no room to put anything in here. Okay, I guess this spot's not gonna work. We gotta keep looking. She's gonna be here soon. Come on. I have the best spot right Where? here. Check this out. Ah! Don't hit the wall. Is that the break in? Make the spot. Dude, I think there's way better secret entrances we can make than breaking the wall. So let's keep looking. Ooh. Oh, I don't know. There's not much room yeah, underneath there. And if she sits on it, someone's gonna scream for sure. We're running out of time. Come on. Oh, no. We should use the washer as a secret entrance. You'll never guess that we're going through there. I've literally done a gymnastics challenge against you, and I know exactly how flexible you are. And you're definitely not fitting in there. All right, let's keep looking. Like you guys, there's literally a jet ski in here. You think we could fit in there, Makai? No. We haven't found the spot yet. We were seriously almost out of time. Where's Sean Michael? He said he was looking for a spot to hide. Hey, I found a spot right here. I don't think I can go under there, because if I do, it's going to be tilted at an 8% slope. Let's keep going. I found a good spot inside the pool. What about here? I'm not going to fit in there. Yes, you are. Put your arm in. Uh, yeah. I'm not, I'm not. There's bugs in there. Let's keep looking. We have to find a spot right now. What do you guys think about this giant trampoline? I don't know. It seems like the best spot, honestly. There is a lot of room underneath here, and that'd be plenty of room for us to hang out, and she would never find us under here. A secret room would not be a secret room without a secret entrance, so we need to make this entrance look as secret as possible. Leave it to us. We're really good at building secret entrances. Well, John Michael is better than Cam the Builder, so I do believe he can build the perfect thing to disguise it. After deciding the trampoline was the best spot, we had to make the entrance hidden and secret. Y'all ready to build? Yes, sir. All right, let's go. Okay, I think the best entrance might be right here at the skirt, right? Oh, I don't think the corner is hidden enough. I think we should try the other side. While the squad stayed back to build the room, I went to Target to pick out the decorations for the inside. I just got to Target. I have to hurry because the fast's going to be at the house soon, so I have to pick things out for the secret room. Because I doubt she's going to find me quickly, I want to get something comfortable because I bet I'm going to be in there for a long time. What if we build an entrance through the pit? I don't think we can get through the do that. All right, let's try this. Ow! Yo, I think this is the best entrance right here. Hey, don't crawl through there. Check it out. Hey, thanks. Oh, come on, hustle. Don't forget the hat. Jeez. Oh, that was so perfect. Yo, give me my helmet back. Whoa. Come on, yeah. baby, let's go. Bro, I know, it was a little get stupid helmet off. All right, we need to get supplies and make this thing. <laughs> Yo, there's so many carpets right here. I'm just gonna go with this one because it looks fluffy. Like the video if you think a fat's gonna find me by the end of this video, or subscribe if you think she won't find me. We're making this decoy. She only gets five attempts, so hopefully this works. Come on, hurry up. I'm crying, it's so hard. I'm gonna get these pillows because they match the carpet and everyone that's hanging out in there is gonna need to be comfortable, so let's get a couple. Let's keep going. So my thought was to fill up a morph suit with foam blocks, but uh, they didn't really come out as the best decoy. So I think we're gonna have to blend this into the foam pit so that way it kind of looks like a person. We'll see. I mean, I guess that'll work. Good enough. I'm running out of time. She's gonna be back to the house soon. What should I get? Yo, a blanket. That looks so soft. Oh my gosh, it feels like the softest thing I've ever felt. We're definitely getting that. Oh my gosh, lava lamp. I already have this one, so I'm gonna get this purple and pink one. It'll look cool in there. Oh, I'm really gonna need some plants. I really like this one because the inside has to feel like nature because you're gonna be in there for a while and you don't wanna feel like you're stuck inside. There were so many things I was picking for this room. I was flipping out. I was so excited. I really need to get some food. Oh my gosh, Swiss rolls. Literally, I have Swiss rolls built into my stomach. I definitely need those. I love zebra. Cake. Those are gas. There's so many snacks. I don't know which ones to choose. Maybe I'll just get all of them. I almost forgot about the cosmic brownies. Literally, I don't know which food fish to pick. I love the flavor blasted one, but I kind of like the original. We're gonna go with both. There's so much food. I literally need to hurry back to the house, but I care more about this food. These are so good. I love these. Come on. Y'all know she's a big chocolate fan. Let's get the nuggets so we can put them down quicker. What else is there in here? There's so much chocolate. Oh! 
Pista Bulls. These look so good, but I literally don't like the ones with nuts in them. But the milk chocolate ones look really good, and I love Mr. B, so subscribe. Definitely gonna need some Doritos. The squad must be going in right now, building the secret entrance. I need to pick out good stuff for this. Meanwhile, the boys were getting to work. If my girlfriend finds me by the end of this challenge, I have to give her $10,000. I don't know why I put that much on the line. Yo, Shark, you need to hurry. Yo, you guys almost done? Yo, you need to get a TV that's under 35 inches to fit the hole. And you're gonna need a ton of lights to brighten this thing up. But most importantly, you gotta hurry because we only got like 30 minutes, so hurry up. What? Dude, I'm finished shopping right now. She's gonna be back soon. You guys aren't even that close. All right, peace. Let's go. What would be the inside if I didn't have glowing lights? I mean, I have to make the inside look super unique because it's going to be so cool. Look at these glowing strips. These are literally going to be awesome. There's a whole curtain of light. That actually looks insane. Let's get all of them. These security cameras have the best live action. So I think I'm going to go with a couple of these to set them around the house. All right, so I have to be strategic about this. So the entrance is pretty small. So I'm going to have to get this 32 inch TV so that it can fit through the secret entrance to get inside of there. We really need to hurry. She's almost there. All right, I just got all the stuff from Target. Now it's time to decorate, but we got to get it through this whole table. It's crawling there, and we'll just pass it to him. Let's go. Oh my God. All right, all right. All right. Good power. If my girlfriend finds me by the end of today, she's going to win $10,000, but I don't think she's going to because we're going to make this room super secret. Yeah, I'll just take a little nap. Three, two, one. The most important part is going to be the TV for entertainment, but we have to make sure it fits through here. Bailey did give me measurements, so I think it's going to work. Oh, it is. Perfect. Get the TV. This Apple AirTag is my next decoy. So what a fat doesn't know is I actually found this Apple AirTag in my pocket last week, and she kept trying to act like she was a psychic and knew my every move, but I know how she knew. So I bet that she's going to use this Apple AirTag to try to look for me, so I'm going to hide it under this trampoline so she wastes one of her searching spots looking here. Hopefully she checks here. That's gonna backfire. I'm gonna place food at the entrance of this mini tramp because a faff might think that I'm using that as the entrance to my secret room. Cause I've been gaining a lot of weight lately, so she'll probably assume that's where I am. If a faff can find me in five attempts, she will win the $10,000. Inside the secret room, I have a shark pillow, you know, just in case you wanna take a nap. You need a nice soft pillow. Here's all the money in case a faff finds me, which is probably not. I have a bunch of pillows for everyone to lay down and chill with while watch Netflix. Wait, where's the remote? I better find it before a fat gets back because I'm trying to play some Fortnite. I have tons of snacks. Literally, animal crackers are my favorite food ever. And I have a plant because it has to be nice and calm in here. On top of that, I have all these snacks that we got from Target. But most importantly, I need to go set up the security cameras before she gets here. She's going to be here in 90 seconds. We need to go. That's going to be here soon, so I need to set up some security cameras. All right, that's right at the front door. That's another great spot. Okay, I have one over here at this section. That's good. She's almost here. So quickly, I set up cameras in all corners of the house, then went back into the secret room and hid. A fast going to be here in 60 seconds, and the boys are literally so dumb, they left the secret entrance wide open. Like, they're so dumb. Finished! And then she got home. Hey, Fa. Jack is hiding somewhere in here, and you have to complete five different challenges in order to get five different chances to search for him. I can sign up for this. And if you find him by the end of the day, he'll give you $10,000. Here's $10, his contract. $10,000? Wait a second. What did they do to my house? Let this happen? Um, they did it all by themselves. You think I would help with this? Dude, I wasn't even gone for an hour. This is insane. You want to find out what the first challenge is? No, but... Yes. The first challenge is you have to break three rules from one of these rule boards. Dude, I thought it was a challenge. Breaking rules is fun. If there's one thing Jack hates is when I'm super loud. So I'm going to scream and see if that makes him come out of his hiding spot. I wonder what rules she's going to break. Since Jack decided to turn my house into a trampoline park, I'm going to break the rules on his trampoline park. First rule I'm going to break is screaming. A fat was jumping on the trampoline above us and had no idea that we were half a foot underneath her. We just moved in and I'm pretty sure our neighbors hate us. I don't know if Jack's calling me lazy with this one, but it says no laying down. So let's go lay down. He even did the outside. <laughs> All right, this is the perfect place to get a tan. A fat just went outside. I don't know why, but she already jumped on the trampoline and it literally got so yeah. close to a so jump here. Shh. Whoa. Whoa. This is literally fire. The boys gave me a dare, so I did the impossible. I actually ordered Uber Eats while in the secret room. And when a fat was in the backyard, I ran out and got Starbucks. I literally don't know how she didn't see me. Hopefully these challenges are going to get harder because honestly, this is 
really easy, but the next rule I'm going to break is no shoes on the trampoline. This is a brand new trampoline, and I'm pretty sure Jack's going to be mad at me for doing this. Oh, and it said no flip, so let's just do a front flip. Since you completed one challenge, you get to search in one spot. One spot? This is going to take all day. If Papa finds us by the fifth challenge, she's going to win $10,000. My $10,000. Okay, I have to be really strategic about where I look, and when I was on the trampoline, I'm pretty sure I saw somebody. So, let's go look! Oh my goodness! Wait, is this gonna be a one-hit wonder? Wait, what is this? I'll give it to the boys. They definitely tried with this morph suit, but they didn't try hard enough, and I still have four other chances to find Jack. You have 30 seconds to complete this obstacle course. Yo, this is so funny watching her do these challenges. For real, it's like watching a movie. For real, oh, you dropped one. I dropped a couple. Mm. Feed me. Gotcha. Mm. <laughs> Wait, what? I have to go over the pool? I'm scared. What? Let's go! Yo, she just completed the challenge. That means she's about to come for us. No. No! Way. Okay, all right, we gotta be very quiet. John Michael, you ate a lot of beans last night, but you have to stop. If she smells it, she might look over here. You completed that challenge, so you get to look in one more spot. All right, I feel like this is gonna be the one. Let's see where Mr. Jack has been hiding. Adriana, do you wanna give me any tips? I'm not allowed to, because I also signed a contract. On top of the secret room having everything, we also have neon lights that keep rippling throughout here. This is literally so cool. It's almost even cooler than the actual trampoline itself. What? Oh, wait. Wait a second. He has his favorite snacks under a trampoline. So maybe he's under this trampoline, but honestly, I feel like he can't fit there. So I have a better idea. All right, so what Jack doesn't know is I put an air tag in his shorts last week because I just wanted to make sure that he was being good. And he's wearing those same shorts today. So maybe I could just find my air tag. Wait, I literally see the air tag is in here. Okay, it's downstairs, that's perfect. If it was upstairs, that means it's in the laundry, but it's not. I'm literally on top of the air tag right now. Mm, I'm hyped up on coffee. I haven't blinked a single time looking at this iPad. I'm watching her every move because she's not going to find us. The boys have obviously given up on security, but I can hold the fort down. Dang it, I blinked. Jack, your time is over! Are you kidding me? That's actually scary because there's just an air tag under this trampoline! Which means he knew I was trapping him. Anyways, what's my next challenge? The next challenge is <gasps> clear the wall. You have to pass all three levels to be able to search for Jack. Level one, easy. Piece of cake, level two. Oh goodness. All right. <gasps> okay, that one was actually harder and I'm getting really scared for level three. Level three. <gasps> you got it. Come on, three, two. I mean, you cleared it, so yeah. Let's go! For this one, I'm gonna look somewhere unexpected because at this point, he's ditched the trampolines. I feel like the trampolines are just here as a decoy, actually. I have to think outside of the box because, wait, maybe he's in the garage. Oh my gosh, she was getting super close to the trampoline. We were all ducking, hoping she would not find us this time. Like the video if you think she's going to find us by the end and subscribe if you think this is the best secret room I've ever built. All right, I'm gonna do it. I'm opening it. She's never gonna find me in here, and I've actually been in here so long that I can actually stretch while I'm in here. Next challenge, the floor is lava. Get to the backyard with only using the trampoline park. How am I gonna do that? There's a secret way, and I'm not allowed to tell you, but you just gotta think trampoline. Can I touch those mats or no? No. What? Only trampoline. Got it. Does this count? Yes, it's okay. connected to the trampoline. Ah! Wait, ooh, you thought this was gonna be hard? Let me not talk. It's gonna take her 45 years, but she got it. Okay, you know what? If you keep talking, you won't make it to 45 years, okay? <laughs> you know what Jack was thinking when he decided to 
challenge me, but there's one thing that he should always know is that you can never be at that. This is like a workout and a challenge, honestly, but let's go. She just completed another challenge, which means she gets another chance to search for us. And honestly, this house only has so many spots that we could be hiding and she's picked some pretty close ones. So she may or may not find us. Remember, Faf, this might be your last chance to look for Jack because the next challenge is really hard. Great, that's really nice of you to encourage me. So just get him on this try. Oh my gosh, guys, she's so close. I feel like I need a better view of the house. So let's go upstairs and get an aerial view. My legs. My legs. It doesn't look like anybody's downstairs, which makes no sense because why would he build a trampoline park and not even hide there? <laughs> but I think he could be in one of these rooms upstairs because he's always filming for YouTube. So where else would he be? She's terrible at searching. She's been searching for an hour. All right, this is like the only place I could think that he would hide that isn't in the trampoline park. Honestly, I literally don't know where else he could be. Wait. All right, buddy, your time is over! Now I'm starting to really get bad. Because honestly, I've broken half the house and I haven't found him, so I'm starting to think I'm gonna lose the $10,000 and I really want it. Faf has one challenge left and if she completes it, she gets one more chance to search for us. But if she doesn't even complete the challenge and she doesn't get the $10,000, I told you guys this was gonna be the best room by far. She's never gonna find us inside of here because she's not even gonna make it through the fifth challenge. Next challenge, you have to jump through five shapes without breaking them. Okay, that sounds easy. I thought you said it's getting harder. Yeah, but the shapes are really hard and they get harder and harder each level you get to. I thought you were my friend. I am, and I really want you to win. Well, it doesn't feel like it right now, okay? Remember, Faf, if you break it, you get a strike. If you get three strikes, you can't look for Jack anymore. Let's go! <laughs> All right, this is gonna end really bad. Faf completely snapped that board in half. I literally do not know how she's gonna make it. A $10,000 prize makes people crazy. I heard that. This is level two. This is level easy, okay? <laughs> Ready? <laughs> Why? Dude, I don't know how she's broken two already. She literally is not gonna break the third one. I doubt it. This is level three. And if I, you have to make this one and all of the rest of them because you already broke two. And if you break three, you can't search for Jack. You never said how I need to get through the shite. So, I mean... I'm sorry, but that counts. Nobody said I had to jump. I'll count it. Level four, let's go. Woo! Ah! Jack, I'm coming for you! Level five, give this video a thumbs up if you think I won't be able to do this, and subscribe if you think I will. Come on, Crap, you got it. Oh! oh. Yes! I'm about to find Jack. A Faf has just completed the last challenge successfully, which means she gets another chance to search for us. And I heard her say that she heard us coughing. Who coughed? You coughed. What do you mean, who coughed? Bailey just coughed again, too. <laughs> okay, Faf, this is your last chance to find Jack and win the $10,000. Or not win the $10,000. Okay, I believe in you, so you really have to think. Let me get a better view of things right now. So I feel like they're in this room somewhere. But I can only look in one spot. Could they possibly have built a secret hidden door to their entrance? I can tell you that they did build a secret hidden door. Oh, thanks for telling me that on my fifth try. All right, I need to find some kind of hidden something. I don't know if Adriana's helping me or harming me. I don't, I don't know if there's some kind of deal where she gets the 10,000 if I don't find it. So I'm kind of skeptical here. Abba, I am helping you. I only have one chance. If this is a decoy, I'm gonna be really mad at you. I don't know what to do! I'm not gonna do it. I am your best friend. I would not steer you the wrong way. Definitely not. Dude, there's nothing in Hold on. Give it to me. Why? Why? Oh, she found us, so she gets the $10,000. Oh. Come on, let's go. You guys let's should go. really get better at finding hiding spots because this isn't that good. A fact, you wanna go shopping? You know what, that sounds really fun. Let's go. All right, let's Subscribe go. if we should build a better room.